The city fringe attracts people that want to do things differently. You would say that. Is this a trend or is disruption woven into its history? I'd say yes. Not this kind of disruption. Are you actually going to buy anything? Let's take a look at the pioneers of industry and culture that have walked these streets. In 1576, James Burbage and his friends wanted a dedicated space to put on their plays. So he secured the lease on a barn and built a theatre on Curtain Road. And as one of his friends was William Shakespeare, his plays were rather good. It's considered the birthplace of modern theatre. The Gainsborough Film Studios opened here in 1919. And it's where one of cinema's most influential figures started his career. Sir Alfred Hitchcock went on to make such classic thrillers as Psycho, North by Northwest and The Birds. Car, car. Stop it. Car. Opening in 1738, the Whitechapel Bell Foundry used new techniques to create bells of epic scale and harmony. And it's where the 13-tonne Big Ben was cast. Sir Benjamin Hall, the Bell's engineer, gave Big Ben its name. Lucky it wasn't named after his brother Richard. It's still an impressive clock. Pioneering modernist writer Virginia Woolf was a central member of the Bloomsbury Group, whose early meetings were held here at 46 Gordon Square. Her legacy continues to inspire writers, readers and scholars around the globe. The Whitechapel Gallery opened its doors in 1901 and was one of Britain's first publicly funded galleries. The art gallery premiered world-renowned artists such as Gilbert and George, David Hockney, and Frida Kahlo. From a small office at 37A, Clerkenwell Green, the Russian Revolution was said to have been planned by Vladimir Lenin. He would stop by here to grab a pint and meet up with Marx. Not that one. Communist jokes aren't funny unless everyone gets them. The Fringe has always been a place for pioneers. And it's still true today. Companies such as Snapchat, TikTok and LinkedIn are now proud to call this place home. So if you want to challenge the way things ought to be done, we're here to help.